Tonight, one Auburn woman breaking records, grabbing her one millionth butt. I'm just overwhelmed and shocked that I even had to pick up this many. Sally Dolly is her name. She's also known as the Butt Lady of Auburn, and she's made it her mission to clean up her city by picking up cigarette butts. And today she hit a major milestone. CBS 13's Sharon Roger with more on this special achievement. Christina and Tony, a lot of love on this Valentine's Day for a woman so committed to her mission. Today we walked around with her in this parking lot and we picked up a few dozen cigarette butts and that was tiring. So imagine one million. Here's one here. Oh, here's one here. She finds them everywhere, from the streets of downtown Auburn to parking lots. You know, I keep track on a daily basis on how many I pick up. 978. I just just kept going. But after but, Sally Dolly sweeps them up. I've picked up a little over 3,000 cigarette butts in one day. She uses her clicker to keep track. I am at 999,974. 980. This Valentine's Day, Sally was 26 butts shy of 1 million, a milestone she's worked almost three and a half years to get to, and that has given her a special nickname around town. I'm proud to be the butt lady of Auburn. <laughs> And uh, I just didn't realize I'd get all the fame. That fame and recognition evident in this show of support in the parking lot of Mel's Diner. One million! <laughs> just ex excitement and proud of her. And, and to me, it's inspiring. To think about how much of her life she spent picking up cigarette butts. That's pretty incredible. Since she started her mission in 2014, the city of Auburn listened, putting cigarette receptacles around bars and restaurants. I would like people to just take the message that don't throw the butts and maybe don't smoke. On a mission to clean up her city and protect the animals, this butt lady continues to win hearts around town, hoping someone sees her story and gets inspired. There's a lot of people that if they just would look for opportunities to make a difference in the world, it would be a better place. And she's not stopping here. Dolly says the community support is encouraging her to keep going, and she's even being sought after by other cities for her help. One million. We did the story when she first started picking them up, right. so it's Good come a long her. way. A long, long yeah. way. Sharin, thank you.